Yo, what is up YouTube with your boy Breezy Kicks, the sneaker fiend. Comment down below, let me know how your week's going, what's your latest pickup. If you haven't subscribed already, make sure you hit that subscribe button and hit that like button if you like the content. If you don't, it's all good, it's love on this side. Today, we got the Apex Reacts in the Flyknit Cream colorway. And make sure you guys follow me on Instagram at Breezy underscore Kicks 23. It's your boy Breezy Kicks, let's get it. Starting off, we got the box. This is also the same box that the Utility Reacts came in. Uh, I made a review on those, the black colorway. Uh, if you guys don't know already, I thought those were absolute trash. You can go watch that video. I did not like that sneaker. Same box, you know, you got like 0023 Jumpman, uh, size 10. They do retail at 190, but I was able to get them for 160. This last weekend, Nike was doing a $30 off on anything over $150. Saturday, I took an L in the Travis Scotts, and I was like, you know what? I need to cop something after taking a loss to make myself feel better. That was a tough L to take. I'm, I'm not even gonna talk about it. Now, let's get into the sneakers. That's what you guys came here for. Bam! The Apex Reacts flying it in this cream colorway. I'm really digging it. I actually really like this. I am a sucker for flying it. It being flying it, that's a plus already, but I'm digging this colorway. I haven't tried these on foot yet or anything. I will be doing an on foot video for you guys. I'll probably throw a quick little clip of it in this video. Before we get into that, let's just talk about this colorway. You got this cream like color. It reminds me of like eggnog. It kind of gives this Christmassy vibe, you know, especially with all the red little hints around the sneaker. I really do like this fine it. I think it looks so dope on a pair of sneakers, and I think they killed it on this one. Now, shoe is very light. I think it's going to be a very comfortable shoe, very breathable. Per that the React bottom's super comfortable, so like the mix between it, I think it's just going to be perfect. Talking about style, man, you just hit on everything. Just crazy design going on. So you got the strap in the back, cool little ad. Now, it doesn't really do much as far as adjusting the size or anything like that. You're really not gonna get anywhere by doing that. You're not gonna be able to make it fit better. Utility Reacts, I made a review on those and I hated the fact that the strap didn't do anything because I felt on those, it was supposed to bring your heel in kind of to fix the whole sizing error. Oh, is it true to size, half a size up, half a size down? They were trying to fix that whole problem. But with this, I feel like it's more of just a design. It's just kind of for aesthetics. All right, guys, so talking about comfort and sizing, first up, sizing is perfect. Go true to size and you'll be good. Now, comfort, man. These are the most comfortable sneakers I think I've ever worn. I feel like I'm walking on clouds, that flying it, super comfortable, that React outsole is amazing. I highly recommend these as far as comfort. Like I said, true to size, so if you want these, go true to size. Anyway, we'll get back to the review. Let's talk about this React outsole. You got that white midsole with the translucent outsole, kind of patches in the back, and then up in the front around the toe section. Now, I don't think this traction is gonna be really good for ball. I don't think you should play ball in it just because this foam area, for one, that's just gonna wear out as you play and it's gonna cause for some slippage. So even though I haven't played ball in these, I'm, I can already tell it's just not gonna be a great basketball sneaker. Now, you can do what you want. If you wanna ball in these, go for it. Look at the laces, you've got a cream color going on with hints of 3M 
and then red running along the laces. I think that's pretty dope. I really like this pull tab up here. One thing is this tongue is super thin. I think it's gonna be very comfortable. Now the tongue has a lining going around it in 3M. You know, a little pop going around, as well as the heel section, you got some 3M. And on this little tab for the strap, you got that 3M as well. Hints of red, like on the strap right here. The heel tab, so on the back it says, Inspired by the greatest player ever, designed for flight. Then the insole, you got Jumpman in there. Now one thing I really like about the sneaker, and I think it's really dope, you got this leather on the insole. So this cream type leather material. It just gives it a premium touch. I really do like that. I really do like the design. I like the colorway. So the React Mitzel, very comfortable. A lot of people like it. Flying it, a lot of people like it. Like I said, I love flying it on a pair of sneakers. I think this is going to be a really dope shoe. Very stylish. Very comfortable. Uh, I do recommend it. If you're willing to pay that 190 that's the big if. You know, if you're willing to pay $190 for this, I highly recommend it. Now, I'm lucky because I did get it on a sale. Uh, an extra 30 bucks, I probably still would have caught this, honestly. There you guys have it. Let me know what you think of the sneaker. Do you think the price point is worth it? Are you going to cop now that you've seen this video? Did you already cop? If so, how did you like the shoe? What do you guys think of the colorway? Let me know, comment all that good stuff down in the bottom. Again, if you're new to the channel, make sure you subscribe. Hit that like button if you like the content. It really helps out a lot. I really do appreciate it. That being said, it's your boy Breezy Kicks. We out.